I've been sewing since I was six years of age. I learned to sew from an older sister. My mom used to make all of our school clothes, so someone in the household was always sewing. I also create handmade dolls and altered book art. I'm inspired by other artists, mainly from the mid-century modern and Harlem Renaissance period. I've interpreted many photographs and paintings and pieces of sculpture into textile art inspired by those artists. Well, I enjoy the Harriet Powers pieces. This is Harriet Powers second quilt. This is the pictorial quilt. Her first quilt was the Bible quilt and both of the quilts depict images from Bible stories. They also depict events like solar and lunar eclipses and even a circus that traveled through her part of the country while she was alive. I try to make each piece of my work a teaching moment, whether I'm teaching a technique or teaching some history about the fabric, the origins of the fabric, or if I'm teaching about African American quilting in the overall scheme of American history. I enjoy doing the replicas because I love applique. And so with the modern things, you're doing more piecework. With the historical pieces, there's a lot more applique. And I enjoy the needle turn applique. We've been speaking with Allison Allen. She is a contemporary artist in the fabric. And she creates quilts that are historical as well as abstract, beautiful. Just come to the Edward D. Museum and you can see some of her work. And we'll have some workshops down the road that you can attend and learn more about her work and about her. We just want to thank her for coming today and you all have a good day.